of real fishing here. Psycho Dad. What a crazy name, right? I don't know about you, but I've been hearing a lot about these. It's made by Konami, which is under the uh, Gary Yamamoto company. Not much to look at from the outside, actually. Can't really see the baits. <clears throat> now, right off the bat, with uh, these, um, if you're interested, apparently it's like a really decent bait. It's a nice new offering. Only downside is you get five in here, and this costs over $5. It's about $5.50. Uh, this is all from a tackle warehouse order. Um, so yeah, you're looking at over a dollar a bait. Which makes Senkos seem cheap. The color I got is green pumpkin blue. Let's take a look. Okay, so right off the bat, um, this bait here I believe is a four inch bait. It has uh, Relatively slim profile as you can see you got these little legs on the side here, but they hook close to the body So it looks like it'd be a pretty good bait for a flip in or you know, punching through cover From what I've seen um, people or it's being marketed as also obviously a good trailer as well as to be used um, not only as a jig trailer, but as a swim bait or a spinner bait or chatterbait trailer because these uh, They really start going crazy when you reel it at a constant speed they may not look like they have anything particular to them, but they do. Let's look at the bottom here. Okay, so one of the things you have is on the end, you have a little bit of extra material there to use it with like a, you know, a flipping hook with a barb. So you got a little bit more meat there, just material. Right here, you have a hole. And the whole head here, this whole section, up here is a cavity so that's hollow there's nothing in there and that's where the rattle goes right in there I believe it says it takes a seven millimeter rattle on top here you have a very small but little recession there you can bury your hook or kind of lay it in that groove you have some uh, interesting fine details here little spikes here along the arms on both of the claws you have these indents there and there you kind of see them and I think that might have something to do with catching the water and making these things move erratically uh, the claws themselves are split and open I had wondered if they were filled with air and I don't think they are although they're incredibly soft they're definitely not hollow but it almost feels like maybe there's a little tiny air pocket in the middle. I don't feel like cutting open the claw <laughs> and ruining one bait. But it will, I guess we'll all know soon enough for all those of us who have it. And a uh, little antenna. That's pretty much it. I do like that the legs are going this way. Although they're kind of small. Uh, because you figure when this is weighted, your weight's down here and this is coming through the water like this the water passing over the bait like this would cause these legs to flail out except there's not a lot to grip they're so skinny there's no widening or paddle to, paddle to them so um, you know and also the the speed at which it's going to go down there's just not a lot of stuff here to really catch water and give it a lot of action so they're there gives it a little something extra on the sides makes it look I guess maybe a little bit more alive get a little shake there a little twitch when it's down in the water who knows but that's the Konami Psycho Dad. And uh, I forget, I'm, I'm sorry, I just was talking to him the other day. One of my subscribers, he has a great video of this in water. Uh, he just has it in the tub. But what you can see and what's really important is that this bait is buoyant. Uh, not like a Z-Man bait where the whole thing floats. But I guess something is done with these claws, whether the material is different or there's air in there or whatever. But when it's on the bottom, these claws go up. You know, it does like one of these. So they're up. 
which was the most important thing to me. I wanted to make sure that this thing rose in the water, and it does. So that's it. Konami Psycho Dad. Really good looking bait. Excited to try it. Alright everybody, thanks.